Hey guys, it's Brock. Uh, so this is the last video I took before Ripley passed that was meant to be on YouTube. This won't be the last video you see of her, but this is the last one that I shot before she passed away that was intended to go on the channel. And I didn't upload it because I wasn't quite happy with how it turned out and I just kind of rambled a lot. And I have a lot of footage that I haven't uploaded for the same reason that I'm going to now, just so there's as much of her as possible out there. Um, we still have the fundraiser going on, gofundme.com slash Remembering Ripley. Still have a few feathers left, not much, but those are going to be going out shortly. Again, if you donate at least $50, um, and then email the address to Ripley at toucan.tv when you do. You must email, because I'm getting a lot, so. <laughs> but again, guys, I'm so, so, so grateful for you. I can't even express the gratitude in words. Um, I'll have some exciting news for you shortly, and I'll keep you guys updated with everything regarding Ripley and the future of the channel, so just stay tuned, and I hope you guys enjoy this as much as I did watching it again. Yeah, I know, it's been a while since we've done another video, but... <clears throat> had a long couple of weeks and I haven't been in town much so I went to Oklahoma for a while and ended up having to come straight back because well my great-grandma got put in hospice and um, unfortunately she died shortly after and then I went down to Houston to see my dad and then was informed that the funeral for my grandma, who lives here in Louisiana, is going to be in Oklahoma because that's where we're from. So I drove straight from Houston to Oklahoma and then back here. And it's been a very exhausting and emotional few weeks or month or whatever you want to call it. And I haven't gotten to see Ripley as much as I'd like to. And she's very happy that I'm back. And she's having her for the uh, excuse me first warm bath of the winter. So winter's kind of hit us hard here, and it's gotten really cold. I've had to do my draft proofing in her room just to make sure that um, she doesn't get too cold while she's trying to sleep. If you own a bird, you should know that drafts can be very dangerous to them, extremely dangerous. So we're just spending a little time together today and I wanted to update you guys and just let you know what was going on and remind you yes we still are doing that video I mentioned before very excited about it it's just gonna be slightly delayed so yeah anyways really glad to be back home for now at least <laughs> And I should be home for most of this winter, maybe up until spring of next year, so. Like I've said before, I haven't been able to do this completely full-time yet. I still have to go and do various different productions here and there and help out. I do have to go to Orlando here not too long from now. I forgot about that completely now. Probably be in January, but... Hopefully we can continue doing these vlogs and man, it's just been exhausting lately. So, but Ripley's enjoying her bath. So that's a good thing. Hopefully she can come with me next time. <laughs> She's very excited about having a warm bath. She just discovered it not too long ago. And now she's all about them, so. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. Guess who escaped while I was gone? <laughs> I had to come back and put her, put her back in last minute. I have a camera that I keep on her that I can monitor her while she's gone. And uh, that friends and family take care of her. Usually I try not to be gone for too long. 
because I want her to be able to exercise and be able to see me so she doesn't get too emotional. She doesn't really get emotional, but uh, she is excited when I get back usually. Sometimes not so much, like if she's asleep and I get back and she wakes up because I open the door, yeah, then she's not too happy with me. But if she's awake and I get back, then she loves me. <laughs> she's not a morning bird, that's for sure. I guess maybe she takes after me there, if that's even possible. What a fun bath, huh, Ripley? She's always up for a bath. I think I am going to take her with me to Houston next time I go. She's been to a lot of places in this country. Together we've gone to, let's see, Nebraska, we've gone to Colorado, we've gone to Los Angeles, we've gone to Orlando, we've gone to Tennessee. She loves road trips actually. I need to try to get a video of that soon. For some reason she loves to look out the window and just about the only time that she actually sits still is when that happens, so. Otherwise, she's bouncing off the walls like you see here, but probably even to a worse extent, if I'm being honest. <laughs> Look at her being cute. Let me zoom in a bit. Are you being cute, bird? I swear that her taking a bath and just scratching her beak like that is like the most relaxing sound to me for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> oh geez. Well. She's probably going to be a while. Maybe we should give her some privacy. Anyways, thanks again, guys, for your patience. If you want to get further updates or more frequent updates, I should say, Instagram's a wonderful place. They also have a Patreon account. So check those out in the description. And I'll see you guys very soon for a very special video. So keep an eye out for that because it's going to be it's going to be a big one, I think. Have a good night, guys.